Yeah, as discussed before, there is a difference of opinion, a respect of the permissibility for women during their menses to read and recite Quran. Where the vast majority, Imam Abu Hanifa, was Shafi'i, or Malik, uh, Ahmed, and others are of the view that it is not permissible because of the Janaba. There are some other scholars who said it is permissible because there is no solid evidence that says you should not recite Quran during the uh, menses. It says you shouldn't recite Quran nor pray uh, if you are in Janaba. And the Janaba is very wide. Uh, a man experiences the Janaba after having sexual relations or experiencing with dreams. But for a man, he has an easy access to take a bath, ghusl, and then he is clean. But for something like that, which is experienced on a regular basis, maybe seven, eight, ten, or more days for women, so they said it is permissible. Uh, if you want to go with the opinion of the vast majority of the scholars, then the alternative is to recite azkar and dua. And if you recite Quran by heart, or from your uh, smartphone, uh, following the second opinion, you're not blameworthy, and inshallah, you'll be rewarded for that.